YouTube is poop with lives. Hi to anyone who's joining this. The live ended. This is what I don't like about YouTube streams is that they are just so not great. Like they're very laggy and they just randomly end. But hi to anyone who's just joining this one. It ended because yeah. But I was in the middle of talking and now I can't even remember what happened. I'm just like disappointed because the live ended. <sighs> if this is your first time on my live and you don't know, these kind of things happen a lot and it's just that the lives just randomly end. And whenever I'm live, you guys will probably notice that I always look, I'm always looking this way and I'm looking at a timer on the live right here for me. And I noticed as soon as I looked at it when I was on my live, it completely froze and I was like, the live is going to end because that's what happens. The thing freezes and then it ends. Anyways, sorry about that. Now the other live is going to be weird because it's all laggy and it's, it's confusing. But anyways, we're back here. Thank you for understanding. Um, but yeah. Anyways, let's get back to the questions. Let's hope this live works out. Have I watched Winx Club? Well, I watched Winx when I was younger, but I didn't watch like the newer one of it. Why can't Bunnix tell Ladybug about Hawk Moth's identity? Well, there's always consequences and you can't use things for like your own gain in Miraculous. Like, the point of Bunnix having the Miraculous is to make sure that everything's happening at the right time. So, for Bunnix to have gone through all that trouble in Cap Blanc when she could have just told him, like, from the very beginning, like, okay, Gabriel's Hawk Moth, you know what I'm saying? So, um, anyways, uh, so if it was that easy, it would have happened, but there's always consequences with that kind of stuff. And not only that, but, you know, Ladybug asks, like, who the Hawk Moth of the future is or whatever. So, from my theories and stuff, the future holder for the Butterfly Miraculous is going to change. So, while Bunnix could say, yeah, well, in while he was Cap Blanc, it was Gabriel, but it's probably going to change. My, what's my, or you asked me, my, what's your favorite show besides Miraculous? So I recently started watching SAO, which is an anime show. It's really good. And I also love, I didn't really watch this that much anymore. But if you guys know Monster High, I love Monster High. It's so fun. And they're coming back this year, 2022, coming up. So I'm really excited for that. I think either Faye or Sabine's relatives will get acclimatized in Shilin. I agree in the sense that I believe it's going to be um, well, I guess I, I disagree, but I think it's going to be Marinette's grandma. So I, that's what I'm thinking is going to happen for episode 20. Have I watched Teen Titans? I have not. Uh, what do I think is going to happen in Kuroneko? So that episode for me, it's going to be focusing on Felix and he could be accompanied by a senti monster, but at the same time, I don't know if he will. I think he might. He might. Why did the live end? It's because YouTube just completely froze and then it went. That's why. If this is your first time on my lives, these things happen. Luckily, the past few lives I've done, like, it was fine. You know, nothing, nothing crashed or anything, but these things are really common for some reason. Uh, yeah. Do I hate Lila? I don't hate Lila. I don't like Lila, but the thing is that in any show, you need someone who's going to be the antagonist. And for me, I like Lila as the antagonist. She's funny because her lies are just so not good, yet she manages to convince people that they're real. And I mean, we can't forget the classic, Marinette pushed me down the stairs. That scene is just hilarious. Uh, oh, and I saw, you guys know of Squid Game? People were making like how um, miraculous, like what would happen if the miraculous characters were in there. And it was so funny how Lila would be out. She'd pull like a marinette pushed me and then she would get out. Um, 
But yeah, if you're back on the live, welcome back. The other one, it just crashed. I don't even know. It just completely froze and then, yeah. Maya, do you still think that Marinette will get akumatized this season even after all the titles? Yes, I do. I do. Um, and especially because episode 22 is titled Ephemeral. It's a very pretty name. And um, I have a whole video on this. So I'd really suggest watching my video because I go all in depth about every piece of info that I've pulled together that makes me believe like, okay, this is happening this episode. My speculations. Uh, will I delete this live later? I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I just keep this one up as well? Because normally, if you don't know, um, I know Pokey, you've, you always come to my lives here, but when uh, my live ends and I have to make a second one, normally I just end up deleting it. I see someone said, keep it, keep it. Okay, I will keep it. I will keep it. Um, but yeah, I will keep it up. Uh, yeah, I normally just because I'm like, uh, yeah, I won't delete it. Don't worry. Okay. Uh, do I think, oh, this is an interesting question. Do I think Adrian will get akumatized? I do, which is weird. But let me just tell you my thought process. So my thought process with Adrian getting akumatized is that, well, here's the thing. I'm between, now both of these things can happen, but I'm between the two of them happening. Like I feel like it's either one or the other. And I feel like Either Adrian will renounce his Miraculous, Plague, I renounce you. <sighs> That's going to be so sad for Plague. And it's not like Plague can go with Adrian. Like, you know, he can't just go with him wherever he's going. Like, are they not leaving Paris? They're going somewhere else. But, you know, like, look back in the episode. What was it? It was... Mm, well... Miracle Queen? I don't think. No, it wasn't. I don't know. Honestly. But the episode where Audrey gets akumatized, right? Marinette was going with Tiki and saying, like, Tiki said, like, I can't come with you if you leave Paris or whatever. Because the Kwamis have to stay with the boxes. Um, but anyways, my point is that it's like, I'm wondering, okay, let's say Adrian renounces his miraculous. I feel like everyone has been expecting like a Cat Blanc 2.0, but I've been thinking more so like, what if it's Adrian akumatized again? There's been a lot of parallels from previous seasons. I'm literally, you know what's weird? Whenever I'm on lives, guys, I always just start coming up with more theories. Sanya, I gotta make, no. What do you mean with end? Okay, so when I say end, it means that the other live crashed, so it just completely ended. It's still gonna say it's live, which is so weird. But if this is your first time, or if you've been here before, you just know that my uh, lives, this happens with them. Yeah. So back to Adrian being akumatized. Someone said, any Mary Shat, please? There's gonna be Mary Shat in episode Glaciator 2 coming uh, October 24th. So stay tuned for that. But there's been a lot of parallels, which makes me even more convinced, like if Gabriel realizes Adrian's turning against him in the finale, will he akumatize his son again and use his emotions to his advantage? Episode five, Psycho Medium, there is no info on that episode. If there was, I promise I'd share it immediately. You guys know I share the info, like literally the second the info comes out i'm already on it but i uh, i think it's very possible because also the question is who's going to be akumatized in the finale it's going to be super it's going to be a very powerful person and i'm just like who it would be weird if it was adrian i don't know how i would like feel about that but at the same time this just keeps appearing in my head like this thought that he will be do I think Marinette will tell her family about being Ladybug? So I think I made a theory about this and I do think it's very possible that she's going to tell her parents because I would assume, like for one, dearest family, it sounds as if she's saying something very in a formal way to them like, dear family, I have to tell you something. And also if her parents get akumatized, which they are, they're going to get a magical charm. So. This would be like the first time someone found out about her identity that's actually like safe.
because they're gonna have a magical charm unlike Alia or Luca but at the same time I'm not too sure if they will or not I think the pot the possibilities there I even made the theory on it but yeah it stopped yeah the other live uh it it crashed do I think Luca will tell Marinette that he knows I do not think he's gonna tell her do you have a theory for episode 22? I do. Check out my Marinetta Kumatai's video. This is what the video looks like on YouTube. Like, this is the thumbnail. My theory remains the same, even with all the new titles and everything. Um, but it's this video. This is the one. Marinette and Lila. So yeah, this is uh, my theory video for episode 22. And... My theories have just, they've remained the same. Um, hello, Savage Kwame. When is the next episode coming out? So the next episode is going to be coming out October 23rd. This is going to be coming out in English from Disney USA. But here's the thing. Gloob. Gloob is quiet right now. It is not like them to be quiet. Like, I have a feeling they're going to air the episode before then. Possibly a different episode like Gear for Grass. Who knows? Um, so I feel like because October 12th, apparently that's this coming Tuesday. Apparently it's something like Children's Day or something. I'm not too sure. But come on, Gloob. Knowing that they like love to celebrate these kind of things, I feel like they're going to share something with us that day. It's not been confirmed, but I'm just thinking like, okay, it's Children's Day, everything. So that's what I'm thinking. Am I turning 16? I am this November. But that's what I'm thinking about. And so for now, the, epi the episode dates that we have for Dear's Family is October 23rd. When will we see the 100th episode? It's going to be coming out on November 27th. Um, who do you think will save Marinette if she gets akumatized? Alia. Now, some people think it might be Bunnix, which would be interesting because it would be like, you know, Bunnix saved Cap Blanc by bringing Cat Noir to help, but I feel like it's going to be Alia this time. It might be Alex, though. Bunnix. And that might be the episode we see her get the Miraculous. Yeah. Um... I saw a question and now I can't even remember what I just read. <laughs> um, do I think Lila will be coming back? 100%. Her voice actor even shared with us um, that she's filming. And if you guys want to see my video where I talk all about my tears for Gabriel Agrest, as well as like Lila returning, then you can watch this video, which is right here. Lila's back. Adrian is in Senti Monster, but let's say he was born with, uh, created a powerful cures. Well, I believe Adrian is a Senti Monster. Oopsies. Um, that's just my theory, and that's just what I believe. But only time will tell. Do I believe Menon and Chris? I think you mean, do I ship it? No, not really. Uh, do I think Marinette's going to get akumatized? Yes. How many miraculous boxes are there? I don't really know. Like, there's never been a set amount set in the series. I mean, we know there's the Chinese box. There is the one we saw in the New York um, special. And I assume there's going to be even more, like, probably a Brazil one. What episodes am I most excited for? I'm most excited for episode 22, Gabriel Agrest. Dearest Family, Glaciator 2, all of them. The finale especially I'm very excited for. But I can't believe it. Like, we are approaching the finale. Um, And if you guys aren't, like, uh, up to date on any of, like, the latest spoilers, episode dates, and everything, just watch my two latest videos. And when I say videos, I'm not talking about lives. So, like, the live is going to be the first one, but I'm talking about actual videos. Um, I talk about them all there, all the dates. I quickly discuss them in my theories. I plan to have a new video coming out either tonight or tomorrow morning. Would you guys prefer me to, like, let's say I finish the video by tonight. 
would you prefer me to just post it as soon as it's done being tonight or would you prefer me to share it tomorrow morning is felix a senti monster i also think that felix is a senti monster but at the same time i don't think he's a senti monster and i really believe adrian is the senti monster however twin rings the two of them being like twins it all makes sense for the two of them to be senti monsters if Mary Nats not acclimatized in episode 22, who else do you think it could be? Hmm. I don't know because all I've ever really thought is Mary Nats going to be the one acclimatized in that episode. Some other things that I've been thinking about is like, okay, Natalie. But I don't think so. Does Mary Nats have a sister? No. Will Kagami get akumatized again? That's interesting. Um, I don't... I don't think she will. She might. But I don't think she will. Um, okay, I see people saying tonight. So whenever I finish the video, if it's not tonight, then it's going to go up tomorrow morning. But... I'll post it as soon as it's ready. So I would say you can expect it tomorrow. If not, by the end of today. I just have some other things to do today, but my goal is to complete the video. Adrian is not a senti monster. You're welcome to believe whatever you want. There's obviously always two sides to a theory. You can either believe the theory or you can't. No one's saying he is, it's been confirmed. All, we, all I do at least is just put my speculations into a, a video and discuss because it's my video my theories so that's all um but if you don't believe that he's a scenting monster that's totally fine no one knows if he is or not it's just theories what episode is next it's going to be dearest family that's on october 23rd um i already talked a lot about my theories like um, in my two latest videos as well in my last live so I would just suggest watching them because for example like the Chilin episode I already said in my uh, video when the spoilers first came out I'm like Chilin this is for me this is about Marinette's grandma she's in China right now uh, but yeah um is season five the last season no as of right now, up until season seven is confirmed, but even season seven is not the last season. It could be, but for now, that's just the, the latest season that's been confirmed up until. So we could get season eight, season nine. I would love for Miraculous to have as many seasons as possible. But yeah, as of right now, season seven is the farthest season confirmed. Confirmed. My, do you know if the Awakening movie would cost money? Well, you're gonna have to see it in theaters, so yeah, to go to the theaters. Um, but yeah. Do I think Eijugami will return? I do not. And same goes for Luganet. Um, they wouldn't have cut off the ship so early on in the season for them to then again make an appearance. Am I more excited for Gabriel Agrest or Ephemeral? Honestly, I would say Gabriel Agrest just because I feel like I have a better idea as to what could go, what could happen going on into the episode. But again, if Ephemeral is going to be what I think it's going to be, that is so hard to choose because honestly, those two episodes are like a tie for me as of how excited I am for them. Um, Who do I think is going to find out Gabriel's identity? Lila. And again, that's why I suggest watching my Gabriel Agress theory video. It says like Lila's back on the thumbnail because I go all in depth about my thoughts for that episode. Um, since Ladybug is the garden, I feel she has the right to know Kanuar's identity. Yes, but the thing is we have to remember Cat Blanc. That is a huge reason why. And we see that she's still thinking about it. I mean, look in Senti Bubbler. She's still having nightmares about it. So, um, that is a big thing that she has been considering and thinking about. 
Do I think Alex is underrated? Well, I feel like she's never been un um, underrated. I just think that because we don't see her a lot, that could be a reason why she's not like talked about as much. But I mean, she's, she's Bunnix. So Alex is just amazing. She's very, she's chill and she's, she's just an amazing character. I really love Alex. I love Bunnix. Alex is my second favorite. Yes. I love Bunnix so much. Bunnix, Alex, I can, like when I say Ladybug's my favorite or if I say Marinette, I'm also including them as their hero form. Um, do you think L Lilix and Luke Chloe will ever be canon? Oh, I think you're saying Felix and Lila and then Luca and Chloe. Luca and Chloe, no, just because Thomas has gone on about on Twitter how like he would, that wouldn't happen. But for Lila and Felix, obviously I think that'd be really cool. But at the same time, I don't think that they would end up being a couple. Yeah. Um, are the finales, or the episodes for the finale re released on the same day? I don't think they are. I mean, I don't think it was like that for the last season, so I would assume it's not going to be like that again. But that would be amazing because I don't think it's going to be though because that anticipation in between the episodes will be really good. But yeah. Um, favorite season and episode so far. So I'm not going to count season four because it's not done yet. Um, so I'll say season three is my favorite season, although season four is going to be my favorite season once it's complete. And as for favorite episodes, I think I'm going to love Glaciator 2. I mean, every new episode that comes out, I always love it. And, but as of right now, I have too many. Like, I can't choose one. From this season, um, Mr. Pigeon 72 and Wishmaker have been my favorites. Am I in 10th grade? I'm in the 11th. Will Cap Long ever appear again? So, I, I would assume in the sense of like flashbacks or like, like I could never really imagine him being like in reality again, like here, do you know what I'm saying? Um, or something that's like, how do I say like temporarily? It'd be like, it would be like in the case of Marinette's dream, like making an appearance, yes. But actually coming again, I don't think so. Um, do I think Zoe will leave Paris soon? Well, the thing is that I don't think she's gonna um, like leave because Andre said uh, like that she would stay for another like couple of months at least. And if you guys want to know, Thomas confirmed that the timeline right now from seasons one the specials, the movie, everything, like up until right now, it's only been a few months. So I would see Zoe staying till the end. Uh, do you think, do I think Kanye War will get an update? I think you mean upgrade. Eventually, yes, I do think he will. And I'd also imagine that all the other heroes could, or especially Rena. Um... Do you think Kwame's can be akumatized? No, but they can go cuckoo. And we're gonna see that happen to Tiki and Deer's family. What am I dressing as for Halloween? It's a surprise, but you guys already know. Do I think Queen Bee will return? I do not. Deer's family is not out yet, but it's gonna be coming out October 23rd. And does Candy War die this season? No. Um, do you think in the episode of Glacier 2, Adrianette will eat ice cream together? Um, I don't think that Adrianette is going to eat ice cream together. Maybe, maybe, but I do hope that we're going to see Adrian's new ice cream. Um... To anyone who's asking like uh, what my other 
social medias are or like my age, anything, open the description of any video and I have the information there. But yeah, to anyone who's asking like about the episodes like Chilin, Ephemeral, all those, I've just been repeating them. So obviously when the live saves, you can go back and watch them or you can just like in my videos, my latest ones, I've mentioned my theories about them. But for Chilin, I believe Marinette's a grandma. Marinette's grandma is going to be in that episode, but I think it's going to be focused on a scenting monster. What ended the live ended earlier. I'll change the title though to like part two of the live. Uh, but yeah, I think I'm going to answer like a few more questions. Should I? I kind of want to hop onto the Miraculous Roblox game. Should I do that? Do I have Instagram? Yes, I do. It is Maya Loves MLB, or you can just search the MyB show. Uh, ephemeral release date is October. No, sorry, November 27th. Guys, I'm going to hop onto Roblox. I'm still going to be reading the live, but I am hopping on for a second. Honestly, I've been playing it quite a bit. Is anyone going to die this season? No. I don't know. I mean, I would assume not. Who knows? Honestly, who knows? Like, Natalie? What's going on with Natalie? Uh, but no. Like, as for, like, Cat Noir and that rumor thing, no. Okay, I'm hopping onto the Miraculous Roblox game. <laughs> um, do I like Lady Noir more or Mary Chat, Lady Noir? Why was Mary not, not a commentized in an episode of Gang of Secrets? Just doesn't make sense. Like, she was so depressed. Um, well, I mean, I think the episode went exactly how it should have went. But, yeah. My on Wikipedia, I saw that it said the script was from Ephemeral. Mm, I don't know. I will say that there was leaked scripts for both episodes in 15 and 22 in, like, August. I mean, most of you guys here know that that happened, but we can't discuss them because Zag has asked people, please do not share the news because it wasn't supposed to come out. So I won't. And, but the thing is though, I can't say whether or not the ones on Wikipedia were real or not, because again, you can't, like, you need to ask official sources like brand ambassadors, like Anita, Fairy, because they're the only ones that can tell you that whether or not they're real you're not gonna quit youtube after season four right no i'm gonna do youtube for as long as i can and as long as i'm passionate for it but i plan to be here with the miraculous community for as long as miraculous is here like i want to be here till the end with miraculous favorite ship lady noir my you look beautiful thank you um, guys, I'm in the Roblox game right now. We are chilling. Um, oh, I see some of you guys coming here. I see, yeah, I see, I see two of you guys. I see two of you guys. Um, you saw my live with Ezra. It was so fun. It was so fun. Oh, hi, I see you guys all coming now hello everyone <laughs> um if i dress up as ladybug for halloween i should dress my dog as cat noir that would be so funny um i'll probably play some roblox after the live as well if you guys want to hop on my roblox is the maya b show and what do you of the difference between french dub and english dub some lines are different um well Obviously, French and English, they're two different languages, but I don't know. I don't know exactly what you're asking, but obviously any language that's dubbed besides English is going to be a different language that I don't understand, so I need subtitles. Yeah. Has my Culture Fly box shipped out yet? Not yet, but it hasn't for anyone yet. And if you guys want to pre-order it because it's still ready for pre-order, I have it linked in the description of like a lot of my recent videos. 
and it says like pre-order culture fly box now and you can head to that link you can just look at the box you can pre-order whatever you want but i will of course be unboxing it and you guys know i always get zag boxes as well like every month so i think it's gonna be shipping out today and i'm very excited Would you decorate your room like marinettes? No, I wouldn't like marinettes. It's a little too, I honestly, I love marinettes room though, but it's not like it would be too much for my room. And also my room is not nearly as big as marinettes room is, uh, but I am going to be like upgrading it. Like I told you guys in the last live, like I wanna get like a, I have a shelf coming, a big shelf where I can display all my miraculous merch and I'm very excited. What other powers do I think Ladybug and Cat Noir will use this season? Well, that's a good question because we haven't seen them use any power-ups. Do I like Harry Potter? Yes, I do. It's great. Um, but I'm curious, are we going to see them use any like other power-ups? Like in the finale, we saw them use this and it's interesting. I love when they're like lunchtime and then they power up. But yeah, look at all of you guys. Um... Which Miraculous game? Uh, it's on Roblox. But I see a lot of you guys here. This is so fun. Um, but yeah. How many languages do I speak? Just one, just English. Uh, and if it's lagging, guys, try to uh, refresh the live and come back in. You guys know, do I live alone? No. I'm only, I'm 15, guys. I live at home. Uh... I'm just gonna say hi <laughs> but yeah do I think in the future Marinette will be akumatized yes I think in episode 22 she's gonna be akumatized but yeah so I have out probably tomorrow morning just because I know I have stuff to do today for one of the episodes on the list of the new ones that we've gotten and I will have more to come it's so laggy for me it's okay I would just suggest coming out or coming back in but guys this is the best that it's gonna get because this is lives on YouTube are really laggy and stuff so yeah that is everything really that I want to recap um, in this live and I also want to do a my theory video and my take on the episode Kuroneko the one that means black cat in Japanese and stuff uh like I was telling you guys it all in my last live so I'm probably gonna do that as well and yeah like my theories for episode 22 ephemeral they have not changed they still have remained the same as it being marinette akumatized so I would just suggest if you haven't already, watch my two latest videos. The one that says the Gabriel Agreste release date one and then the season four um, spoilers one because, and the one when I say season four spoiler one has like Candy War and Glaciator in the thumbnail or whatever. But I really do recap like most of my theories. Cause for example, I told you guys, Chilin, I believe it's gonna be Marinette's grandma akumatized. But there's nothing more than I can explain that I saw in Superman and stuff like that, which I discussed in that video already. So yeah, I have probably two theory videos coming this week, I would say, um, based off of these new episodes. But I also have a lot of other theory stuff. You guys know, I love to share all kinds of theories, even if sometimes they seem a little far-fetched. The possibilities are endless, that's why they're theories. But yeah, Besides that, I'm just going to answer like a few more questions and then I'm going to go. But yeah. I'm not in the Roblox thing right now because I think it was making the live a little laggy. Um, do I think Lila will be the next Hawk Moth? Yes.
Um, I have a feeling that someone gets Cat Noir's Miraculous and renames it himself. So, as I was saying, Kuroneko, I really think this episode is going to be about Felix. That was my first instinct when I thought about it because of the PV stuff. And I told you guys in my Simple Man video, I was like, all of this, like, us continually, um, us continuously seeing the older Miraculous, the Miraculous anime, has got to be foreshadowing something. And I thought, okay, no, maybe I'm just thinking about it a little too much. No. I really do think that it's happening. And I don't think Felix is like going to get his miraculous his ring or whatever. I just think that Felix is going to get this kind of power or look to be like Kanemar. Like, why do I feel Felix knows that Adrian's Kanemar? I kind of feel like he knows. You guys want to know something else that I've been wondering? If you rewatch the episode Felix, something that I'm like, dang, that's weird is that in the episode Felix, when it's the scene where we see Lady Wi-Fi, Princess Fragrance, Reflecta, and then we see Ladybug, Cat and Felix, you know that part where we see him like use his vision? How did he know to get the iPad? How did he know the iPad, he has the vision, yeah. How did he know the iPad had the Akuma in it? Right? I'm just, I'm just saying. Felix, you're sus. Um, but yeah. How do I think this season is going to end? Well, the finale is going to be crazy. There's always so many things that come out of the finale. But I really do think Marinette's going to confess her feelings to Adrian. Adrian's going to stand against his father. Someone's going to use the Peacock Miraculous that in those two episodes for the finale. And it's not going to be Natalie. Or it could be Natalie and this is like her last time. I I don't know. But that's my main things going on for the finale. And last two questions. Will Lila ever wear the Fox Miraculous? So if we look in Senti Bubbler, um, Gabriel Shadowmoth, he even wanted Alia to give up her Fox Miraculous. And it's like, why? It doesn't matter. But my first thought was he'd give it to Lila because she is like, she's Valpina. Uh, but do I think she'll ever actually get it? I don't think she will. And last question. Um, can, um, Is Ollie going to give the Miraculous back to Marina after Haxon? She did, we saw. And also, keep in mind, Haxon is episode 16. We've seen episode 19. And we've seen Ladybug. And... Is there going to be a time skip? Okay, this is the last question. Is there going to be a time skip between season 5? So I told you guys, I really do believe that... Season 6 and 7 will focus on them in the future. Them as, like, adults. And just them when they're older, like a different time. You know what I'm saying? Also, if anyone wants to see my nails, now they're like grown out and stuff like that. But I had Adrianette themed nails. So my next ones are going to be fun. But yes, do I think that Lila will discover Marinette's identity? I feel like she kind of knows, but at the same time, no. But yeah, that is all for this live. That's all the questions that I'm going to be answering. A lot of the time, I already have like videos on like a lot of theories and questions. Um, but I always do try to answer the comments too. And on my Instagram, <clears throat> right now my DMs are really full. Like I need to get back on track with them being like clean and clear. Uh, but if you ever really like want to ask me something or just message me, you can message me on my Instagram, the Maya B Show. But just know that I'm always trying to answer my YouTube comments. Even though there's a lot, I really do try to get to them all. And if I don't get to it, even though this can be annoying, just try to re-comment it on like another post or like my next video, because hopefully that time I'll be able to see it. But yeah, that was live. I hope you guys enjoyed being here and talking all about all the new stuff, the game, the merch, the episodes, the list. I need to get on to my next video, but I'm so excited for all that's for all that's to come. The rest of this month, it's gonna be crazy. November is gonna be crazier. 
But yeah, bye everyone and thank you for joining. Do a little pound it. And I will see you guys very soon. I'll probably, my, my next live will probably be Tuesday. Like, I feel like that's going to be a fun day to go live. So it'll be soon. It'll be in two days. But yeah, thank you guys for joining and I'll see you soon.